as the title suggests, I'm going to show you my new gonk bag, or sleeping bag, or fucking maggot, or whatever you want to fucking call it. It is, I have trouble pronouncing it. <laughs> it's the bollocks. This one's the Carhinthia Wilderness sleeping bag. And this one here is obviously, um, if you're a fat bastard, um, I don't know who to, to do for a size comparison. Um, I don't know, the size of someone like Brett. He's not tall, so he'll get in it, but it, it might be a bit tight around the um, shoulders. I'm, I'm just saying, Brett, I'm just saying. Um, with this sleeping bag, you can get a right-hand zip and a left-hand zip. I went for the left-hand zip. So, what's special about this sleeping bag? Well, it's the bollocks, basically. You think, what's this here? What's that there and that there? Well, this bad boy's got sleeves. Yes, sleeves. I'll show you in a minute. So you've got a hood. Why KK zippers? But you've got two sets. So I've got it on fat boy setting. So you can, if you want it tight, you can have it on that one. And if you want a bit more room, you can have it on that one. So that's good. Um, the material in this, I mean, it, it cinches right up around the neck there, look. Collars up, cinch it up. Nice fucking hood. And this stuff here, it's... Uh, let's get the tag off me. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm trying to do this like so we're done and It's... Oh, hang on. Fuck's sake. Oh, here we go. Here's, here's the fucking tag, look. Fucking hell. Bear with me. Bear with me. So... Look at the ratings there, look. So that's all the specs. That's all the fucking foreign. So yeah, so that's the specs, right? So these here, and inside you've got a zip here, right? So what you do is you would, hang on. You don't do that zip, so you'd be in the sleeping bag here. Yeah? So then, right, I'm just gonna put this down and get the fucking sleeves out. So you'd open, hang on, so you'd yank this open. You yank that open like that, and the same with it, right? I'll, I'll pause out and get the fucking sleeves out. Hang on. So there it is with the sleeves out. All right? Sleeves. All right? Why is that good? Why is that fucking good? Because it is. Now, um, and then I like this, right? Because then you've got, like, you've got the thumb loops in there as well, look. Right, so basically, just hope the dog, dog, dog don't come. Basically, you can stay in that sleeping bag, and in the morning, if you want to make a brew, you don't have to unzip it and let all the air out. You just get your arms out. And then also, you can undo the bottom. You could tie it up, so you can tie it up. There goes, G, G loft. You can tie it up, and basically, you can walk round with that on, basically. So how fucking cool is that? Um, I think I paid two hundred and sixty pounds, I think. But then again, you pay for what you get, basically. Um, so yeah, that is yeah, you know, got all the cinching points here. So I mean, I've got another sleep bag. I've got the um, Snug Pack Special Forces, but this here, and I've got the Carinthian Bivy bag. But I'll do a, I'll do a. A different review on that. So this is not like a like a review where I've tested it. I've, I've been in it, but me, I've, I've been out in the field a couple of times, and I sleep in it in my van, and it is fucking warm, fucking warm. Um, I haven't had it down to like really cold temperatures, like fucking minus five. I think the coldest I've had is minus one. I was toasty as fucking there. Um, so it'd be nice to fucking go out in extreme weathers. So that's the Carthinthian Wilderness sleeping bag. Um, Oh, I've had it for a while now, and I'll tell you what, I fucking love it. Love it. I mean, it, it, it basically says, says it on the name, really. If you've got the money right for a good sleeping bag, that basically, here he is, look. That basically is, um, he's fluffing up there. But yeah, 
I've had it and it's brilliant. Um, review over. Fuck off.